There's a new extra push this year for people to get their flu shots amid worries of a potential resurgence of COVID-19 cases. It comes as one of the vaccine trials appears to have hit a speed bump. I spoke earlier with Dr. Imran Ali. Dr. Ali, let's start with the news on the Oxford vaccine trial stopped due to safety concerns. What do you make of this? How concerning is it? So, Kenneth, yesterday, this news came this afternoon, yesterday afternoon, actually, where we found out that the phase three clinical trial was halted, not stopped. And we see this commonly with vaccines and any kind of drug where we see an adverse reaction happening in a volunteer. So it can potentially delay the results by a couple of weeks as this uh, period of collecting the data is halted for a bit. But it's so important that we make sure that the vaccine is effective and safe. We're being told it's more important than ever to get that flu shot this year. Talk about that importance. Also, where and when people should get one. Well, a lot of people are home, working from home nowadays. And, you know, usually get your flu vaccine from your employer. So it's really important for people to go out to their doctor's offices and to get the flu vaccine. But you can also get them at your local pharmacy. A lot of people are worried about, you know, getting exposed to virus by going to doctor's offices. But most primary care physicians offices are structured so there's minimal exposure. We're learning more about the long-term effects that COVID-19 can have. What are you hearing about the impact on the lungs? So I just reviewed a study coming out of Austria, which looked at patients who were in the ICU for with very serious COVID-19 disease. And up to 12 weeks later, you still had that lung damage causing significant shortness of breath and difficulties just doing regular tasks. But the silver lining, Kenneth, here is that people who went to pulmonary rehab after the ICU stay did significantly better. So it's very important if you know somebody who is having a very serious time with COVID-19, they can do better afterwards if they get enrolled in the pulmonary rehab program. And doctor, tomorrow night the NFL season kicks off. The Kansas City Chiefs will welcome about 16,000 fans into their stadium only a fraction of the capacity, and this has been approved by health officials. Your thoughts on fans gathering in these numbers? Well, they did the math here. So they kept the capacity at 22% of what you would normally see at a football game here in this case. And the public health officials really looked at, you know, the spaces and how people can socially distance. Our thanks to Dr. Imran Ali there. Back to the flu shots, he says, for those who are considering getting a flu shot, they should aim for October 31st at the latest. So a key important piece of information there. That is, he gave some great advice. Mm -hmm. uh